Hi everyone, it's Chris from Linear. Welcome to the online Window Energy Rating Database. I'm going to give you a quick run through today of how to use this easy to use tool brought to you by Linear. In just a few short moments, I'm positive we'll have you confident enough to filter through the database and find out your very own Window Energy Ratings. When the database is initially presented to you, there can be quite a lot of data held within here. This can be quite daunting, but don't worry, our main task is to filter out these combinations and leave you with just a few to choose from. The first filter, seen at number one, is the product suite. So for this example, let's go for Energy Plus. Filter number two is the different types of product categories currently on offer from Linear. So let's go for just a normal case from window. Filter three is our glazing supplier. And for this example, let's choose Sanger Ban. Filter four is the band. And uh, if you just want a C rating, maybe you just want an A rating, you can select this here. But for me, I want to see a, an overall view of all the ratings possible. So I'm gonna leave this one clear for now. So if we scroll down, we can see in the database in the bottom right hand corner there are 149 items left. That means there's 149 simulations still to choose from in the database. As you know, there's, that's still a lot of simulations and we probably want to filter this down just a little bit more. So for me, I will try and filter out some of the, some of the largest filters. So I'll go straight to glazing and I'll choose 424 for double glazing. For the spacer bar, I now want to use Swiss spacer. And I know our glazing supplier only supply hot melt seal behind it. They may also only, or as standard, supply argon and filling. So we'll choose that. And then over here on these two abbreviated columns, if you hover over the titles, we've got is glazing flipper included and is the thermal dam included. So I'm going to select no for both of these options. And let's see what we get. So now all of a sudden you can see in the bottom left hand corner you've got 13 simulations left in this database which gives us a much much more easy to compare and, um, and assess what kind of ratings we can get. So we can see here on the right hand side we've got some C ratings, we've got some A ratings and we've even got some fantastic A plus ratings. Now to make this even simpler to look at if you hover over the WER column and click it once and once again this will sort it so you have your highest rating at the top to send into your lowest rating to help bring up further information on any of these simulations highlight whichever one you want so I'm going to go for this one third one down click it once anywhere on the row and the whole row will highlight in grey and then up here in the top right hand corner, you'll get your linear simulation reference. So if you quote this to anyone at linear, they will understand exactly which simulation you are currently talking to them about. And then hopefully that's enough information for you. If you do need to take this a little bit further, maybe you want to show a document to a customer, or maybe you want to help show one of your sales team within the company, you can click on this item, download PDF. So that will download the PDF for the item that's currently selected. So if we bring that up, you'll see you have a self-populated A4 PDF sheet, which shows you all the details of that glazing combination selected and what kind of rating you can achieve. To reset your filters, you can either, either go through them one by one by clicking on these crosses, or if you want to, to go back to the start, just click on reset all filters. And that's it. Hopefully it's nice and simple. Enjoy.